All right, everybody, welcome back to the brand new on this reaction video. So today we're finally going to be checking out Maison by Dreamcatcher. I'm sorry I'm a little late. I'm still feeling kind of kind of meh with all this like uh, little cold stuff. So uh, yeah, because of that, I might be a little lower energy than usual today. But you know, it's fine. I'm 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 feeling okay. It's not a big deal. I'm like I'm not miserable right now. Uh, and and plus I really want to check out the comeback anyway. So. Yeah, let's begin with it now. Before we actually jump in though, guys, make sure to check out my Patreon where you can see uh, more than 500 exclusive reaction videos in including Dreamcatcher Mind, then Dreamcatcher Live Stage reactions that I don't post here on YouTube, and of course K-drama reactions like my Mr. Hotel de Luna, It's Okay to Not Be Okay, Scully and Hart, ET1 Class, Squid Game, The Producers, and Goblin. So many K-dramas and so many life stages by other groups as well. So if you'd like to check out all of that, the link to my Patreon is down below. As always, guys, if it's your first time on the channel, lyrics later, okay? First I focus on the video, on the song, and then I go back and re-listen to the whole thing with the lyrics. Also, if you don't like pausing, uh, maybe this video is not for you. With this said, let's begin Dreamcatcher Maisel. Bam. Bam. Hello. What? I'm sorry, what? <laughs> Who are these guys? Why? Okay. I, I don't know what I think about the masks. <laughs> uh-huh, uh-huh. Yeah, so right off the start, the instrumental is really prominent, right? So far, it feels like it's really driving the song. Yeah, it's pretty, it's pretty edgy. That guitar is like, gang, 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 you know, like, you catch it instantly. Really like this hairstyle. That's cool what they did with, uh... Uh, black bangs and blonde everything else wow <laughs> whoa I really like this shot because I, I think here so the background is CGI but here it doesn't really look like CGI that much because um, it's kind of blurry and she's in the focus. Yeah. Didn't even realize that we got to the chorus. Hold on, what happened here? Oh yeah, this is the chorus. Wow. It's pretty um uniform, this song, right? In in terms of the instrumental. Oh. I really like how she sounds here again again so first I'm glad about the change of the instrumental it's not a very surprising thing because they usually change the instrumental for dummies parts like uh, to emphasize the rap parts to pull back the instrumental a little bit but just pay attention to to how she sounds and it's like mm, I, mm. there's like a little more oomph than usual like a little more mm, 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 something like like that I, i'm struggling to explain it maybe a little more lower end or something especially on Hidari something, right? 
기다리다가 딱 봐도 보이지 않는 미래 후회할 때는 이미 늦었던 걸 알아 어 오케이 편하기만 하면 닥쳐 이상하게 닥치 이상해 닥치 마치 말라가는 이 양심과 똑같이 후어 Yeah, so here this choir type of effect, the background vocals are pretty cool. Mm-hmm. Okay, okay, so I think I already know what the song is about, but... Oh... Oh, come on. Okay, so we're gonna pull up a lyric video, see what this one is about, like, see everything that it's about. So let's do it. Okay. Let's go. Kidaridaga. You see this word right here. Listen. Oh, I really like how she sounds here. Mm. Wow, yeah. Mm. 
right so this was Maison by Dreamcatcher so with this one it's I think it's pretty cool that they're trying something um, sound wise something very new maybe if we're talking title tracks the closest thing would be something like scream but still it feels very very new and like like a really new thing that they're trying out it doesn't really sound like any other song by them maybe some b-sides but can't really think of anything right now and i know their discography very well i listen to their uh, b-sides pretty often and uh, yeah to me it's like a new sound a new side of them that's one thing second i think the main point about this whole experience here is the lyrics and the message so i like that it's uh firstly i really appreciate that it's easy to understand like sometimes the message is really profound but uh i don't know about you guys but i'm not the best at decoding metaphors uh and and difficult lyrics so sometimes i need to like i need people to explain it to me or watch some kind of explanation uh so here i could understand the message right away it's like on on one hand maybe they're singing from the perspective of the animals right because they're singing home and then like jungle ocean polar desert so that's homes of animals uh about climate change all of that uh, then talking to people so overall like the message of the song now uh about the music video and the song itself right the sound um and as always my personal subjective opinion here uh unfortunately this is gonna be one of my least favorite title tracks by them i can't really say that i connect to it so once again it's cool that they're trying something new but this new thing didn't really work for me i didn't feel connected to the melody um the sound and and also the melodies that they were singing that's one thing my favorite part is definitely dummies rap like i really like how she sounds there and the instrumental that goes together with it um and also it's one of my least favorite music videos just because of heavy incorporation of cgi you know we've had some cgi in odd eye and some other music videos but there it it wasn't really that prevalent you know it looked uh <clears throat> i don't know maybe because it was trying to imitate something that doesn't really exist in real world odd eye was like this cyberpunky type of theme so you don't really have a real life reference for that so you're like oh okay it's just an imaginary thing so cgi didn't really bother me in that case but here uh i just i i don't know i i don't really like cgi in music videos especially when it's really heavy like that for for the background you know not for some type of effects like some some object but for pretty much the whole video right Every, all of the background was cgi there was really no way to do it differently because you can't go and destroy a city just to create a set but at the same time just sharing my honest opinion i didn't really enjoy the music video that much you know like the fact that they are in the music video definitely makes it better so uh, i like their presence but you know the ev everything else can't really say that i felt it uh so yeah something like this overall uh, interesting experience and definitely looking forward to listening to the whole album that's that's for sure i'm sure i'm gonna find some awesome awesome b-sides that i'm gonna like there so uh something <clears throat> something like that thank you all so much for watching sorry about the voice and uh let me know how you feel about this one and I'll catch you guys in the next video as always take care keep listening to great music and love